This is JSA TV, the newsroom for telecom and data center professionals. I'm Dean Perrine of JSA, and we are coming at you live on location in beautiful Fort Lauderdale, Florida at Metro Connect 2023. And I am here with my new best friend, Mr. Jeff Greenberg. Jeff is the chief marketing officer at Dark Points. Jeff, welcome to JSA TV. Well, thanks, Dean. I'm excited to be here. I am excited to finally get to, to yeah. meet you. I've heard a lot about you. But for our viewers that don't already know, why don't you tell them a little bit about Dark Points? Sure. So Dark Points, we operate data centers throughout the Southeast, primarily in the Carolinas, mm -hmm. as well as the Midwest, Ohio, and uh, and Indiana. and in, in Indiana. Which is where I live, by the way. Oh, Northwest really? Indiana, that's right. Oh, yeah. interesting. Yeah. yeah, we're more a little bit farther south. We're I'll just come, south I'll come visit. Indianapolis. Okay, yeah. I've been there. And and so we offer, you know, typical DARP, uh, data center offerings mm -hmm. and solutions, as well as um, a lot of uh, security and cloud offerings as well. So we're pretty much a full service provider in, this, in the markets that we serve. Very good, very good. So um, Jeff, you've only been at Dark Points approximately one year. That's right, yep. Uh, to this point. So um, why don't you tell us about what most excited you about coming on as CMO at Dark Points? Well, the opportunity, of course. I mean, there is tremendous opportunity, I think, for Dark Points. We are expecting to grow pretty drastically and mm -hmm. aggressively over the coming years. And last year was no exception. We had a really phenomenal 22. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of investment in the business last year, whether it was on the product side, we introduced several new products as well as uh, infrastructure investment. So mm -hmm. in our Greenville data center, we spent a lot of money there. For Personally for me, last year was a lot about getting to know the company and what our strengths <laughs> are, right? We just expect yeah. that, yeah, for sure. As well as the people, and we've got just a tremendous uh, team. I mean, we really embrace the customer experience and do mm -hmm. everything we can to make that exceptional. So those are the big things, as well as obviously the markets that we serve mm -hmm. and the needs and challenges that our customers or prospects are facing. So a lot going on last year, a very educational year, yeah. much more to learn, of course, but it was a, a phenomenal year. So you, um, I want to say, okay, so you recently made an announcement about a new bare metal and some new bare metal and security solutions. That's right. You want to talk about that? Sure. So, um, you know, one of our things that we focused on is, as I mentioned, we rolled out several new products last year, bare metal being one, security being another, and that really helps round out our product portfolio. Mm -hmm. So we are able to offer uh, infrastructure, security, cloud services, like I mentioned, in these mid-sized markets that we focus on. And um, we're able to deliver those locally. And historically, those have typically been found really in major markets. Sure. So uh, with regard to bare metal, you know, it helps provide a single piece of equipment essentially. So it's a cloud-like service, but dedicated piece of equipment to mm -hmm. uh, an organization where security might be really important. For so sure. that's that's uh, th th the key reason why we we, we introduced, um, excuse me, bare metal. No, I, I love it. It uh, makes, uh, makes a lot of sense with regard to your product portfolio. Yep. Uh, but you mentioned uh, a, a, a growth season yeah. that you've yep. been going through. Um, I, I, I suspect that you think that, or that you believe that 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 growth is going to continue yes why don't you go ahead and make a couple of predictions for us yeah. as far as like what the growth looks like for you what yep. we might be able to expect from dark points in the future so i will say just to backtrack a little bit 22 we had our largest signed um sales year ever okay and i will predict that we will beat that this year so <laughs> that um, is a lofty uh, prediction my friend yeah it I is love it. but you know we the, the investments we made last year in the products really sets us up really well for this year. So I think awesome. we're gonna be able to take advantage of all of that that we did last year. So yeah, I do think we'll have even a better year from a signed sales perspective, mm -hmm. and then obviously from a revenue perspective as for well. Sure. So yeah, we should have a really strong year. Everything's looking really up. Um, first quarter looks good, second quarter we've got you know, learned a lot of things in the pipeline. So yeah, I I'm love confident. it. Yeah, no, and as well, you should be. I'm hearing a lot of really, really great things uh, coming uh, from the Dark Points team. So um, congratulations, number one, on a year at Dark Points. Congratulations on some uh, significant growth. And uh, congratulations on uh, the, the year that will be 2023. Well, thank you. Yeah, we're super excited. I think there's a lot of good stuff going on. Excellent. And thanks for being here on JSA TV. Well, thank you for having me. You got it. You got it. And thank you, viewers, for watching JSA TV. We'll see you soon.